What make you of the dreams of children? Are they little or are they grand? Can you see them on their faces? Can you hold them in your hand? Do they flit around like fairies or wrens before they sing? Are they powerful or fragile? Do they understand a thing about what lies before them, what life may have in store? Are they destined to be realized? If not, what are they for? I had a dream that I was flying through the sky like an airplane or a bird. It was so beautiful. I could see my home, my friends, my family. I swooped through the clouds and into the sunshine. It gleamed and glistened on my face like diamonds, rainbows, and rays of happiness. My dream started off quite frightening. I was surrounded by animals of all shapes and sizes. There were dogs and cats Turtles and giraffes? Too many to count and all of them looking at me. They looked hungry, not like they were going to eat me, but like I was supposed to have something for them. But I had nothing to offer. Then from the fringes of my dream floated all my friends. They carried baskets of food and buckets of milk. Together we fed all of the animals. I woke up with my own dog licking my face. I dreamt that I walked in a beautiful garden, full of flowers that smelled like all of my favorite things. Of course there were roses, honeysuckle, and big white lilies, but there were also tulips that smelled like peanut butter, and daisies with the odor of cotton candy. All of my friends were there, and lots of people I didn't know. The strangers were as varied and different as the flowers. We looked each other up and down, and even sniffed a little. Then we smiled and sat in a circle and happily shared a chocolate chrysanthemum. What make you of the dreams of children? Look now, there they are. 